Welcome everyone to our new video. I'm Laurentiu and she's Alexandra, Twin Flames in Harmonious Union, students of Jeff and Shalia and Ascension coaches affiliated with the Twin Flame universe. You know, me and Laurentiu at first were just like friends and uh, I, I never thought I admitted to myself that, you know, I, I love him like more than just like a friend. I can have this like in a, in a romantic relationship. I never sing of love if it does not exist, darling, you are the only exception. What is your um, most favorite thing about being me? I mean, everything. <laughs> I don't know everything, but you can just give an example. Mm -hmm. Like sharing my passion with you. I mean, we have fun in many ways, but like... We are, we are having fun all the time. <laughs> <laughs> Even when we just say some random words, we just like start laughing because we're like, yeah. Like we have some jokes that I don't know. I think we just get it between each other. But we're just gonna laugh for hours. You may hold the, the book. Okay. So you don't have to like, on camera, just hold it. Like. It's a deep so. You are so romantic. <laughs> Until now I've sworn to myself that I'm content. None of it was ever worth the risk Well, you are the only exception 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 Today we want to talk to you how watching anime helped me manifest my twin flame. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> You have such a beautiful way to express with each other, a unique way to just be yourself and to be accepted in who you are and really have the safety that they're there for you and you're there for them and all your dreams just come true. Welcome everyone. From this place of Zoom in the Church of Union, we take ourselves out of the usual routines of daily living to witness a unique moment in the lives of two beloved community members, Lorenzo and Alexandra. Today they join their lives in the union of marriage. Their story begins in college where Lorenzo and Alexandra met on a cold university floor. Alexandra was sitting in a graceful yoga pose, minding her body and enjoying the moment. Lorenzo noticed her and did not know what to think. What is up with this girl, he thought. Lorenzo did not know what yoga was. As they made their way to their classroom, 
they noticed that they had the same class together. Soon after they had their first date. Well, Alexander didn't know it was a date, but it was. During their date, they peacefully sat together on a bench in the sunshine. Lorenzo decided this was the perfect moment for their first kiss. As he leaned in, Alexandra noticed and said, I have a boyfriend. This frustrated Lorenzo, but he decided to continue being Alexandra's friend. There was just so much there. They shared a love for God, spirituality, aliens, dragons, fairies, and many other things. There was too much to gain through their friendship to let this get between them. Lorenzo decided it was time to get to know himself on a much deeper level. He felt in his heart a call to go to England. Lorenzo, being Lorenzo, he decided to follow his heart. He left university and went to England. There, Lorenzo found a spiritual teacher and started practicing Kundalini Yoga. Lorenzo learned a lot and opened up spiritually. He experienced his first awakening. This led to a deep place of peace and contentment. It was from this place of peace that he decided it was time to reach out to Alexandra again. They began speaking consistently. Lorenzo helped Alexandra heal a lot and Alexandra began to realize just how much love she felt for Lorenzo. Soon, Alexandra felt the love between them was simply undeniable. She confessed her love to Lorenzo and left her boyfriend. Alexandra traveled to Lorenzo's home in order to patiently await his return from England. Lorenzo's mother convinced his brother to buy him a plane ticket home in order to reunite with his love. Lorenzo and Alexandra were reunited in a fireworks display of joy and love. The rest, as they say, is history. After two and a half years of being together, they knew that there was a powerful connection between them, but weren't sure what it was. They also had a longing for a community in their hearts, but didn't know where to start. Through a divine miracle, they met Sylvia Takas, a student of Jeff and Shlia's body of work. That is where Lorenzo and Alexandra were first introduced to the divine teachings of Jeff and Shalia. Alas, things about the relationship started to make sense. Lorenzo and Alexander chose to join the Twin Flames Universe Facebook Open Forum in the summer of 2018 to learn more about Twin Flames and this body of work. Unsure of whether they were truly Twin Flames, Lorenzo and Alexander began attending coaching sessions and watching classes. Through their continued dedication to their healing, they quickly revealed that they were indeed true twin flames. Now it is present day and Lorenzo and Alexandra sit before you and their choice to permanently ground their harmonious twin flame union and commit to each other as husband and wife. And so it is that Lorenzo and Alexandra present themselves to be married today, surrounded by the people they love. You, Lorenzo and Alexandra, enter as individuals and leave as husband and wife. To be husband and wife in harmonious twin flame union means that you are honoring God's truth, that you are already married in spiritual truth for eternity, and you acknowledge that there is no separation between heaven and earth. As husband and wife living your heaven on earth, you choose to honor and maintain God's divine order by honoring the path of harmonious twin flame union provided for you by God through your spiritual teachers and gurus, Jeff and Shalia. You acknowledge that Jeff and Shalia have guided you to have a deeper harmonious relationship with God yourself and your twin flame. As husband and wife living your heaven on earth, you testify to your one divine life purpose as stewards of the enlightenment of humanity. You willingly choose and promise to put God first above all things and follow where God calls and only as God calls. You are two wings of one bird as husband and wife in harmonious twin flame union. 
you choose to see the truth that you can do more together in harmony than you could ever do on your own as two individuals. As husband and wife living your heaven on earth, when challenges arise in your union, whether in your relationship to God, your union, or the external world, you will use the principles of self-love through inner work that Jeff and Shalia teach, the mirror exercise, and will not hesitate to call on all the resources available to you, the community, coaching, and Jeff and Shalia's body of work. When you face obstacles or blocks along your path, you will leave no stone unturned to resolve them using everything at your disposal to heal. You acknowledge that only you create your reality and you assume ultimate responsibility for healing everything out of alignment with love in your vibration. As husband and wife living your heaven on earth, you choose to grow and expand to receive God's love. You acknowledge that you must be willing to receive more abundance in both spiritual and material wealth. This means that you will continue to improve your lives forever and ever as you continue growing towards perfect union with God and that you see no distinction from the inner and outer worlds, no separation from heaven and earth. All right, we can pause for a moment and just allow all of that to integrate before we move on to the wedding vows. And I invite everyone to just take a moment to ground and feel into your heart space and just breathe. And when you're ready, you can make your way back to the room. Okay, guys, you ready? Yes. yes. Okay. All right, we come now to the words Lorenzo and Alexandra want to hear the most today, the words that take them across the threshold from being engaged to being married. A marriage, as most of us understand it, is a voluntary and full commitment. It is made in the highest realms of everlasting love and deep flowing peace. It is entered into with the desire and truth that it will last for eternity. Lorenzo and Alexandra, I now ask you to declare your marriage vows. Please face one another and hold hands, if you can. Okay. All right. Lorenzo, please repeat after me. I, Lorenzo, choose God's truth that you, Alexandra. I, Lorenzo, choose God's truth that you, Alexandra, are and have always been my wife for eternity. Are and will always be my wife for eternity. <laughs> you are my ultimate teacher. You are my ultimate teacher. My perfect lover. My perfect lover. And divine mirror. And divine mirror. You are my best friend and perfect partner in life. You are my best friend and partner in life. I will not hesitate to love you. I will not hesitate to love you. As I love God and myself. As I love God and myself. And will give God's love to our union. And will give God's love to our union. With all of who I am. With all of who I am. Whenever I feel something out of alignment with love. Whenever I feel something out of alignment with love. I will do whatever it takes to heal myself. I will do whatever it takes to heal myself. And give love where love is needed. And give love where love is needed. I promise to remain faithful to love. 
I promise to remain faithful to love. Our true heaven on earth forevermore. Our true heaven on earth forevermore. Good job. Okay, Alexandra, it's your turn. Alexandra, please repeat after me. I, Alexandra. I, Alexandra. Choose God's truth that you, Laurentiu. Choose God's truth that you, Laurentiu. Are and have always been my husband for eternity. Are and have always been my husband for eternity. You are my ultimate teacher. You are my ultimate teacher. My perfect lover. My perfect lover. And divine mirror. And divine mirror. You are my best friend and perfect partner in life. You are my best friend and perfect partner in life. I will not hesitate to love you. I will not hesitate to love you. As I love God and myself. As I love God and myself. And will give God's love to our union. I will give God's love to our union. With all of who I am. With all of who I am. Whenever I feel something out of alignment with love. Whenever I feel something out of alignment with love. I will do whatever it takes to heal myself. I will do whatever it takes to heal myself. And give love where love is needed. And give love where love is needed. I promise to remain faithful to love. I promise to remain faithful to love. Our true heaven on earth forevermore. Our true heaven on earth forevermore. Good job, guys. Thank you. Yeah. How are you feeling? Pretty good. Very good. Mm. Good. Emotional. <laughs> yeah. Amazing. Butterflies. Yeah. yeah, you guys are doing great. Thank you. Yeah. All right. So now is time for the exchanging of the wedding rings. Do you guys have your wedding rings with you? Yes. That's right. mine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's yours. <laughs> Good. You ready? Okay. Your wedding rings are the outward and visible sign of the inward connection which unites you as one with your creator. Lorenzo, place the ring on Alexandra's finger and repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. Wear it with love and joy. Wear it with love and joy. As this ring has no end. As this ring has no end. My love is also forever. My love is always forever. Alexandra, place the ring on Laurentius' finger and repeat after me. I give you this ring. I give you this ring. Wear it with love and joy. Wear it with love and joy. As this ring has no end. As this ring has no end. My love is also forever. My love is also forever. May the wedding rings you exchange today remind you always that you are surrounded by enduring love. Okay, so now is time for the marriage kiss. And so now, by the power vested in me by God and the Church of Union, it is my honor and delight to reveal you on earth as husband and wife. You may seal this truth with a kiss. 
<laughs> Very good. I am pleased to present the newlyweds, Mr. and Mrs. Benzar. Yay! Congratulations. Thank you. A round of applause. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, everyone, for being yeah. here with us today. Yes. Thank you. You did it. You did. Uh, the hard part is over. And now our special guests, um, any of you would like to share your love for them today, you are welcome to do so. And Lorenzo and Alexander can just sit back here and relax. Hello, Alexandra and Lauren Chu. Hello. Hello. I just wanted to uh, bring, bring us back to Toronto. It's the first time when uh, I really got to see both the, uh, who you truly were. And I saw uh, Lauren Chu, you just basically just walked around and, and loved everyone that was before you and just loved with absolute non-attachment and you really enjoyed loving people and I received your love and it left like an imprint on my heart. Like I'll, I'll remember you from that experience. And I remember just seeing you both together and you both together, just absolutely astounding. And Alexandra, you bring so much joy to a room mm -hmm. and uh, everyone really appreciates your sense of humor. And I also love uh, how you use it as a teaching tool. So, uh, thank you for sharing your union and congratulations on getting married today. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Go. Congratulations, you guys. I'm mm -hmm. so proud of you and happy for you. And um, like Carmel, I met you in person in Toronto as well with Josh. Um, and we sat across from each other at the um, Korean barbecue restaurant. And I just remember Josh and I were new into Harmonious Union and seeing you across from us, um, really sharing your union with you, really looking at your union as a really strong example of Harmonious Union. And through working with you um, in the CEO group of the a Church of Union um, group, I really watched your union not only um, start strong, but, but continue to grow. And that was a really powerful lesson for me. And, and your union is very alive and very thriving and very vibrant and all the choices you're making to go deeper in expanding is exemplary. And I really love and appreciate you. And I also um, really love and appreciate our friendship and all the times we played together and things we learned together and things we healed through together. Um, I love you so much and I just wanted to share a few words that I selected from our gurus, Jeff and Shalia. Um, remember, he's your best friend. At his core, he wants to be with you. So translated for divine masculine. Remember, she's your best friend. At her core, she wants to be with you. It's from Wednesday, 1 p.m. class 7. Um, this is from Wednesday, 7 p.m. class 43. Once you decide on something, then it's yours. This is from Sunday, 7 p.m. class 85. First, you must recognize your foundation, peace, oneness with God. And finally, this is from Wednesday, 1 p.m. class 54. Your harmonious union with God is always there. You're simply coming to remember it. The process of remembering is simple. Divert your attention away from fear. Direct your attention to love. Choose that direction. 
you will be healed. And this one is for your wedding. I am always one with my beloved twin flame from the meditations. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much. Guys. Thank, Thank you, guys. you so much, Lizzie. Love you. Love you too. I love it. Congratulations to you both. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Um, it, it truly has been like such a pleasure getting to know you guys. Um, you're wonderful people. Mm -hmm. really, like, you really are amazing people. And uh, I always look forward to, you know, our time spent together. Uh, we have a lot of fun and, uh, you know, we, we love you. Congratulations. We love you very much. Yeah. Thank you. We love you too very, very much. And we enjoy our time together as well. And our jokes together. And our jokes. Definitely. <laughs> All the laughs. <laughs> Always. Every time. Always. <laughs> Congratulations, Laurentio and Alexandra. Yeah. It's a, it's an honor to be here with you, um, to share this special moment with you. And, um, yeah. Was... Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah. we've known each other for a minute and there have been so many like fun times and so many laughs and yeah. And I just want to say like, you guys have such beautiful hearts and I want to thank you for sharing yourself and your love with the world and your life. Yeah. Thank you so much for having us. Yeah. yeah. Thank you as well. Love you guys. We love you too. Scott. Scott. <laughs> 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 we love you guys. Congratulations. Yeah. Love you too. Thank you. We love you too. Very good. I would like to say some words too. Um, I mean, it's hard to know like where to even start because we just, we've spent so much time together um, and I can feel the emotions coming up. So I'm just going to allow that to, to ground here. Um, yeah, we love you guys so much. And that's about all I'm going to say right now because <laughs> the waterworks are starting. <laughs> yeah. I'll, just, I'll go ahead and say yeah, something. You should say something. Um, we're so delighted to have this moment with you. We've had such a deep and seemingly long journey up to this point right alongside you both. And we're just so happy for you and for your union and for your lives and for your relationship with God. We're just so delighted and happy to be able to share this moment with you. It's truly amazing. It's truly an accomplishment. And it's truly uh, an immense deepening of your relationship to God and your commitment to each other. And we're very blessed to be able to witness this and be here with you and for you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, very Thank you so very much. much. We love you very much as well. Yes. We really deeply do. Love you very much. Yeah. Yeah, I remember uh, the first time we met was uh, we just Colby and I were like, oh, you know, we should get to know these people. Like, they seem really nice. We're going to just reach out and see what's going on. And we just hopped on a Zoom call and, like, back, like, over a year ago. And, uh, yeah, I just knew from the beginning that we would be friends. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. We, we appreciate that. And we, mm -hmm. we remember that moment. Mm -hmm. And we feel the same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Happy to be friends with all of you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Congratulations again on your beautiful marriage. And may it be forever blessed in the arms of God. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. We are very grateful. Mm -hmm. For all of you. Mm. Yay. <laughs> now. <laughs>
I know this was not in the plan, but I want to do something. <laughs> I, I, I know what she wants to do. Since I have a flower bouquet, I want to throw it. I'm going to throw it to all of you here um, watching, and I hope that um, you too will achieve your harmonious union. And Mary, your to Oh. Oh. You may proceed throwing it. Yeah. You may proceed throwing it. I have to feed it in first. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. For you guys. May all your dreams come true, I swear. <laughs> okay, we're gonna throw it. <laughs> Whoop. I hope it looks good on camera. Yay! <laughs> so, so. <laughs> Ring power. <laughs> <laughs>
for me it's just she makes some sounds sometimes that I, I'm, I, I just can't. <laughs> there's some like uh, I, I'm in my room I'm just uh, doing stuff I'm editing videos or whatever I'm doing in my room and then I, I hear some sounds and I'm like 